Um, if you follow anything about League of Legends, we just had the Asian Games happen, which is like an Olympics sanctioned event in Asia that features all Asian countries and they participate like in soccer and cricket, you know, a bun oh, bunch of sports. Football. Football. Yeah, football. Yeah, yeah. There is, yeah, football. Yeah. yeah. And uh. League was a gold medal event this time. And like many League fans, we were ch cheering for Korea because our, our our goat Faker was if he gets a gold medal, he's exempted from uh, his uh mandatory community slash military service in Korea. And little did we see, they they won. <laughs> they 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 defeated their um opponent uh Team Taiwan 2-0. and Faker now has a gold medal and doesn't have to go off anymore. He can continue his career as long as he wants without any pauses. Uh, yeah, um, you know, uh, as most of y'all, I don't know if y'all weren't able to watch because, you know, it was on the other side of the world and the time zones were off and yep. the Olympics uh, blocked off video. Yeah, it was a bit difficult. Yeah, yeah to watch it. So, um, but yeah, we, you know, we got most of the news from from uh, Twitter, and also Mokhtar was able to watch it somehow. Uh, from I find my ways. Sources. Um, but yeah, um, congrats to the... Oh my god, I was about to say T1, but... <laughs> I can't hear you, what happened? <laughs> Hello, are we good? Yeah, I can hear you. What the fuck? I just pushed it up and I was... Okay, anyway... Uh, yeah, uh, whatever. What did I stop at? Or what did you hear? Uh, you said you were about to say T1, and then that was it. Okay, I thought I was going to say T1 because it was majority of T1 team on there. Mm -hmm. um, but as you, as you said, Korea. Yep. Won gold. Yep. Um, those players are now exempt from military service because they have brought a gold medal back to their country. Mm -hmm. And because of that prestigious thing, the country... Uh, pardons them for that um service so yeah so congrats to them and then congrats to mainly esports in general for uh for having the them get into the olympics so yeah it was a big win on the esports side too so good to oh, yeah. see that we are now getting into parts of the world where we're now being involved into the olympics so that's a big win for the esports scene so happy exactly. for that and also for Faker, it's another addition to his career with his three world championships, two MSIs, multiple regional final wins, I am win, and now an Olympic gold medal, essentially. When you like, look up the GOAT of esports, he has he's now he has to be. Like there's at this point he he's won most all all uh no one's got as close to him at this point. Um I mean, I think I think what was like bothering him the most is the military service and like, you know, not knowing how long he had left, and then given this opportunity he had, you know, mm -hmm. he went with it and he went all out on it. Mm -hmm. Um, and I'm guessing now he's happy and now he can focus on uh, continuing on his career without a pause or not knowing if he's gonna come back. Now he can now have his mind focused. He's he said he's feeling a lot better from his injury. Um, if you didn't know, he was injured. Um, he was missing a lot throughout the year. Um, but he feels, he said he feels better. I mean, he's starting to feel better. Um, now the, the teams are now pre prepping for Worlds, which should be coming up soon. Yeah, really soon, yeah. Maybe, what, two weeks, a week? Uh, it's like a week because the Worlds, uh, this year's World song comes out two days from when we're recording on Tuesday. And then World starts one week after that. So, yeah, just a week. So, yeah. Um, obviously, they didn't have much time to celebrate. They have to go back, practice with the teams, get ready yep. um, for the, the biggest event of the year for them. Um, so, yeah, um, congrats, like I said, to them, and congrats to the esports scene and all the other teams that participated in the Olympics. Oh, yeah, exactly. congrats to all the teams, and, of course, congrats to Team Korea for winning the Asian Games League of Legends tournament. Now on to another...